good morning students now today we will discuss uh, three point problem in three point problem there are three methods one is mechanical method in a mechanical method tracing paper is used therefore other name of this uh, mechanical method is tracing paper method no second method is graphical method the other name of uh, graphical method is bessels method no third method is trial and error process or we can say lehmann's method because lehmann's rules is applied in a trial and error process no today we will discuss mechanical method that is uh, tracing paper method uh you know three point problem what is three point problem first uh, i i want to discuss with you what is three point problem three point problem is that when in the field there are three points and we we have to trace out we have to find out the fourth point which is located on the ground but it is not located on the drawing sheet on the drawing sheet three points are there but those three points on the ground are inaccessible due to any reason we cannot uh, set our table at any one of the three points had we can set the table at uh, uh, these three points then we will not apply three point problem then we straight away with the uh, formula of uh, intersection method we can find out the fourth point now i will explain you how this uh, mechanical method is applied in the field no suppose we have three points a b and c in the field there may be four points five points more than three points then we can apply three point problem if there are less than three points in the field then we cannot apply three point problem then we will apply two point problem if two points are there now three points are there but all these three points are inaccessible due to any reason maybe water is standing here and we cannot go to these three points though these three points are visible ranging roads have been fixed on all these three points and we can see these three points from any point but we cannot go to any one of these points no we want there is another point d if this is our drawing sheet and on drawing sheet a point b point c point are there but d point is not there we want to find out uh, d point because we want to do the plan table survey of this area and we want to mark the various features electric pole well hut on the drawing sheet from point d but this d point is not there on the drawing sheet now we want to with the help of a b c we want to find out d point and these three points are inaccessible hum yahan pe pahunch nahi sakte now ho oh, this uh, d point can be found out with the tracing paper now i will draw it now we will fix our plan table at d point we have fixed our table at d point and we want to orient this table 
if orient, orientation has been done, then we, we can be able to find out D point with respect to ABC. But how orientation can be done? No, we have these three points on the triangle shape. Oh no, this point is D. Capital D is written. We will find out uh, this D point uh, on the plane table. Now, what we will do, we will take tracing paper. This is a tracing paper, we will take tracing paper. What we will do, we will fix the tracing paper. No, we have fixed the tracing paper on the table. No, mark any point on this sheet somewhere here so, so that we, we have to draw three lines towards A, B, C. Therefore, sufficient uh, space should be there. Therefore, now we will fix a point here, say D. Now we have fixed the point D. Then now place the elevate at D and uh, bisect A point. Then draw a line towards A. Now similarly pivoting the uh, elevate at D bisect point B by rotating uh, the elevate. Then line will be drawn towards B. This is A towards A towards B. Now placing the elevator at D, bisect point C and draw the line towards C. When the C point is bisected, we have to rotate, move, elevate, not table. Now this uh, line we have drawn C. After this, now remove this tracing paper from the table. Now tracing paper has been removed. Now fix the sheet on the drawing sheet on which A point was there, B point was there and C point was there on the drawing sheet. Now place a tracing paper on this table. When you place the tracing paper on table, then A line should touch, should pass through A point. B line move the tracing paper or rotate the tracing paper in such a way that B line should also pass through this B point on the drawing sheet. But a, a point should not be disturbed. A line should touch, should pass through A point. Now B line is passing through B point. Now C is not passing. C line is not passing through C. Now move, move this tracing paper in such a way that C point should also pass. C point should also pass through this uh, C point. C line should pass through C point. This is a piece. When ABC lines are passing through ABC, then with the paper pin, insert the paper pin at D, on D point on the tracing paper. Insert the paper pin in such a way that uh, this pin has impression on that drawing sheet. When uh, the 
it will uh, have the impression on the blank sheet. Remove this tracing paper. Then this uh, point will be your D point. D point uh, has been found out. Okay. Once this D point has been found out, now with the help of D point, now we can orient this table. Then for orientation this table, we will place elevate on line AD. After placing the elevate on line AD, rotate the table now. Rotate the table in such a way that without moving the any date, A point is bisected. When A point is bisected, now your table is oriented. To cross-check whether it is oriented or not, place the any date at B point, build the B point and bisect this B point by moving any date. When B set is bisected, then draw a line. This line will pass through point D. Similarly, by placing the elevate at C, bisect point C by moving the elevate in such a way that C point is bisected, then draw a line. All three lines will meet at one point D. Per chance, if these lines are not meeting at one point, at one point, then there will be a small triangle, which is called triangle of error. Then there may be a mistake uh, on our side, then we will mark the point within the triangle. That point will be our D point. Now this is all. Next time, uh, we will uh, discuss another method of uh, three-point problem. Thank you very much.